Settled already? <laughs> well done. I'd better go kiss her goodnight before she drops off. Well, there you go. I bet that's them right now. Who's Bruce? That's the desk. Hairpin. Could be useful. So I suppose I could try the manual transfer switch. Go do it. <sighs> Not getting out that way. Hey. Hey! See us. Get some rope. We should tie up the hostages. Hey, did you hear something? I'll check the back door. Zoe's up there. She's scared of the dark. They're coming for you. You know that, right? Shut up, Joyce. I'm serious. Should we run? Take our chances cross country? Just keep quiet. Let me think. Zoe, it's me, Pumpkin. It's Daddy. Sure. Any minute now. I don't want to go to jail. Then maybe you'd better hide. Listen, I'm gonna get us out of here before... before the lights come back on. Okay? With Mommy and Grandpa? Of course. We won't leave them behind. Guys all right? Oh, you found her. Thank God. Where are the holts? 
I think they went out the back. We need to get out of here. Give me your wrists. Are you hurt? No. Are you? Okay, go! Everybody down! Don't shoot! We're hostages! Stay down and don't move. Where are the perps? Dangerous. I'm not dying in this goddamn motor lot. What the hell are you doing? Grandpa! <laughs> Sanchez is hit! I knew this was a bad idea. Fall back! Fall back! Hold fire! Repeat, hold your fire! I said 30 fucking yards! You try that again, and every last one of them leaves in a body bag! Oh. Jim. Jim, can you hear me? Oh, jeez. All right. Okay. Vince? Is Grandpa uh. hurt? I don't know, honey. Jim, are you okay? Dad, he needs an ambulance. Get him an ambulance. He looks all right. Maybe just a concussion. It's not just that. He's got a brain tumor. If he got hit in the wrong spot or something. Oh, shit. You still with us, Grandpa? Oh, God. This is... this is all my fault. If I hadn't been so hell-bent on making amends... Hey, are you with us? Uh, Why'd you sprint for the door like that, huh? I shouldn't have come back. I never even paid the bill. What bill? Jim, what are you talking about? Uh, I'll, I'll be all right. I, I just need a, a minute to, to get my... Easy now. He needs to see a doctor. Dale, go see if you can barricade the second floor. Mm. <sighs> what? No, no, stop. You listen to me. What I want is a helicopter or I start killing hostages. Huh? That's right. And safe passage to Mexico. Mexico? Since when? Since now. Look, you boys are in way over your heads. You couldn't even nail a burglary. Now you want a helicopter? Spare me the lecture. Can you do it? I'll look into it. First, I need to show a faith. Let one of the hostages go. I ain't much of one for faith. All right. So let's make it practical. You must be hungry for a hot meal. All right. How about we send you food, you release a hostage, and then I start on that helicopter. Does that work? Pizza. 
Enough from that shitty joint in town. Franco's. Bet you delight. Give me 20 minutes. <sighs> Good news, folks. One of you's going home. Finally got confirmation from the movers. Tomorrow morning. Good to go. Hmm. At least we get one last California sunset. Thirteen years ago, I couldn't wait to leave St. Louis. First person in the family to go to college. <laughs> My mom. I'll never forget that look of pride as she waved me goodbye. But you know what? I never realized how proud I'd feel to be going back. I just wish it didn't involve so much stuff. Ugh. Is there anything more stressful than moving? I hear divorce is stressful. Anyway, tonight is our last night, and it seems so long since we, you know. Mm. So, how about we make it one to remember? Wake Zoe. Hello? Well, thank you. It's been nice working with you, too. Oh, I'm sure you'll all do just fine without me. Hey, do you mind if I, um... <gasps> Vince! Hi, is this Bruce? Uh, can you put Michelle back on? It is Bruce, right? Yeah, it's Bruce. So? I hear you like cupcakes. Vince, give me the phone. Weird, he hung up. Have you been looking at my phone? What are you fighting about? <sighs> Zoe. Hey, you should be in bed. I, I couldn't sleep, even with my star lamp on. Daddy? Yes, sweetie? We'll always live together, right? You, me, and mommy? Why would you ask that? Hannah's parents used to argue, and now they don't get to live together anymore. Don't worry, honey. We're not doing that. So, uh, this Bruce dude. Hmm? Oh, he's just one of the macroeconomics lecturers. We did some research together on the Ecuador financial crisis. There isn't much else to say. You never said anything about him before. I have. Plenty of times, but whenever I try to talk about work, you switch off. I don't switch off. I just don't remember you talking about him. Let's forget about all this. Don't let it ruin our last night. We've got a long few days ahead of us.
Something about it doesn't add up. You've been working late, more than usual. Because I... Because I'm changing schools. I need to leave on a high note. You know, last week you said that you had to stay in great papers. But you came back smelling of... of wine. And perfume. Look at me. Vince. I know things have been hard. This last year wasn't a great one for us. But nothing happened between me and Bruce. Can you please believe me? Michelle, every bone in my body tells me you're sleeping with this guy. Now you're being ridiculous. All right, then give me your cell phone. What? I want to have a look at your messages. Have you got something to hide? No, of course not. So what's the problem? What's the matter? It was a mistake. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. God, I was right. I don't know what to tell you. It just happened. It just happened. You made a choice, Michelle. You chose to do this. Jesus. You don't need to raise your voice at me. It was stupid. After the accident, you were so... Neither of us were in a good place, and he was... I don't know. He was there. Has he been here? In our apartment? Did the two of you... No. No, of course not. So where, then? Does it really matter? I just want to know. It was his place. Always at his place. Look, it was just sex. That's honestly all it was. Come on. Sex is never just sex. I'm not trying to diminish what I did. I'm just trying to explain it. I felt so rejected. You haven't touched me in months. You haven't looked at me. When was the last time we even watched a movie together? When you lost your job, this wall went up. You pretend everything's fine, that you don't need to talk, but the wall just gets higher and higher, brick by brick. And I missed you, okay? How dare you turn this back on me? I'm just trying to make you understand. Look, I know you're hurt and angry, but I can't undo what I did. You want revenge? Have a one night stand. That's not the point. I don't want to sleep with anyone else. I want you. Vince, I did a stupid thing. It was meaningless, but it happened, all right? If I could take it back, I would. Will you at least sit down so we can talk this through? Oh, God, Michelle. What a fucking mess. I don't even know what else to say. 
Can you ever forgive me? I'm sorry, but I can't pretend this didn't happen. Maybe Bruce could, not me. Vince, think what you're saying. Think about Zoe. There has to be a way. I don't think there is. What about Missouri? I don't know. I guess we'll work something out once we're there. I need to lie down. Vince, I'm worried about your dad. Head injuries, bad enough on their own, but if he's got something up there pushing against his brain... How's he doing? In pain. But he wants Zoe to be the one sent out. And Vince, he's right. We've seen what these people are capable of. Please, just get her somewhere safe. Okay, I got your veggie pizzas. We want to get them while they're hot, so send me a hostage. Come on, old man. You're going for a walk. Not me. Please. T take Zoe. I'm... Uh, well, there's nothing wrong with me. I don't care who goes, but only one of them. It's gotta be Zoe. She's seen enough for one night. Fine. Take her out, grab the food, come on back. I'm watching you, Vince. I know this is scary. But you're gonna have to be a brave girl out there, okay? I will. Come on, kiddo. Hey, look, you dropped this. <laughs> Her name's Owl. Owl, huh? You know, they can see in the dark. Thanks. Okay, they're coming out. Stay right where you are. Got eyes on two hostages. One male, one female child approaching from the front of the building. Over. Daddy, is Grandpa going to die? <sighs> Some things grown-ups can control, and some things we just can't. What if you don't know? Why did you leave him inside? Because nothing is more important to us than you. That's far enough! I'm Sheriff Romero. I guess you must be Vince. Best if we make this quick. You know how much I love you, right? All... all the way to the moon. That's right. You get scared, you just look up at the sky and remember that, okay? Okay. Put the kid in the vehicle. Stay with her. Daddy, please, don't go! I have to, Pumpkin. But what if you don't come back? You know, all the best things about me, they're part of you. Already. 
So wherever you go, I'll always be with you. You will? Always. Hey, hurry it up! Come on, kid. <sighs> Give him the food and send him back in. I know how hard this must be for you, Vince. But I've got good news. Yeah? We're about to have a man on the inside. Hang in there, buddy. We're rooting for you. Now pick him up and don't do anything stupid. Hey, don't forget the napkins. Two-way pager. I'll be in touch soon. Enjoy your pizzas. Hey, it's the pizza guy. You're late. No tip. Well, what do you know? Cop kept his word. Pizza ain't hard. A helicopter, though. Look, I know you didn't want this, but you got Romero wrapped around your finger. You do. <sighs> I really hope you're right. I spent ten years saving up for this place. Ash only just started to feel at home. How can we stay here now? We'll give the walls a fresh coat of paint. Replace the glass, you'll see. It'll be good as new. It's not the walls. It's what happened within them. Vince, is Zoe okay? She's fine. How's your head? Throbbing, but I think I'm gonna live. So, did you meet the sheriff out there? Yeah, you could say that. What's he like? Clever guy. Plans within plans, if you know what I mean. Hmm. I'll tell you something I learned early on in life. Never trust a cop. You want my take? Steer clear. Now, don't share this, but Dante's a cousin of mine, and him being sheriff? Ain't no one in the family thought that was a good idea. What are you doing? I'm counting out cash. Jay, you gonna eat? <sighs> Not hungry. I want it to be over, Tyler. All of it. It'll be over when we win. You remember that? And do your part. You need some goddamn food. Share that with the rest of us? Um, nope. Don't think I do. Are you serious? Are you deaf? Hmm? No, you can't have any. What do you mean we can't have any? There's six pizzas. For us. So back the fuck off. You asshole. Paul has low blood sugar. It's fine. I'll eat from the vending machine. No. I said no. The answer is no.
Come on, man, just share the food. Here you go, getting all up in my shit again. Why should I? Huh? Isn't it worth a few slices to shut everyone up? If I wanted to shut them up, I'd just fucking do it. They giving you problems? Nah, I got this. Ugh. Shit, sorry. Idiot. <laughs> Clean it up. Mm. You know what the trouble with you is? You get too fucking involved. If you just stay quiet to begin with, we'd be gone by now. <laughs> Never thought of it like that. What you don't get is, this ain't us. We needed money, but it's not like... Tyler, he built shit. Jay's into nature, me. Yeah, I robbed the liquor store once, but I'm getting a job soon. There's this girl I got my eye it's on. It's not here. Though, why Jessica would date me after this shit? I got no idea. Don't you have a cousin you can marry? Keep it in the gene pool. What the hell did you say? Nothing. It was... It was just a joke. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Gene pool, huh? <laughs> Good one. Well, anyway, enjoy the pizza. Wait up. Just tell him I stop complaining. And hey, about your old man, you know I didn't mean to hit him so hard, right? He just ran and I... Sure. Whatever you say. Well, I'll be damned. Thanks for backing me up just then. Hmm. No problem. Make sure you save me a slice. <laughs>